Honorable Members of Parliament, good afternoon. Happy New Year. Let me say how wonderful it is to have you at the beginning of the year, to be able to share a meal together, and to be able to take this opportunity to thank you from the bottom of my heart for the commitment, especially those of you of the National Assembly, showed during this holiday period. We all know that it was a very difficult holiday period because of all the challenges of COVID and many other things. And people had the opportunity to say, let me just stay away and look after myself. But you turned out in huge numbers. You left your homes, you left your families, came out in huge numbers to pass a couple of pieces of legislation that are going to be a game changer. The passage of the anti-money laundering bill, for example, will ensure that we are able to continue being part of the international financial system and to have a respected banking system that can only help improve and mature our economy. The bill on uh, NHIF and the other acts around the health sector are now going to open up and give us that opportunity to be able to give our people that which we promised them of universal health care. And the political parties amendment that we are trying to push through which some people have tried to demonize as they try to demonize BBI. That is giving us an opportunity for us to be able to formally work together across political parties in the interest of the nation. Because this is what we are trying to achieve. As we sit here today, yes, I am a proud member of Jubilee but I'm an even prouder member of the Kenyan society which I see reflected around these tables here. To be here with leaders from across the divide. And this is really what we are trying to, to achieve. To say that we may belong in many different homes, but we can actually work together for the common interest of 50 million people. Law making and even constitutional making is always a work in progress. Even the oldest constitution, democratic constitution of the United States of America is still a work in progress. And you've got several amendments, which they all the time quote to you, Amendment 5, Fifth Amendment, Sixth Amendment, and so on and so forth. So there's really, it's not a crime for somebody to see something is wrong in our constitution or in our law that we need to change. Because it only makes things better. They say that uh, a good idea always yields to a better idea. And a better idea would yield to the best idea. So what you guys are doing is basically trying to improve governance in our country. So we really want to thank you very, very sincerely for what you did.